everyone. Josue and I are having an incredible time here at Big Cat Rescue, thanks to Scott Lope, who is the Director of Operations of this fabulous facility. Scott, tell everyone out there, what is Big Cat Rescue all about? Well, Big Cat Rescue is a sanctuary, so it's a permanent home for over 140 unwanted cats, and they come from everything you can imagine that's bad. There are unwanted pets, there are police confiscations, we even have zoo animals where the zoo went out of business and these animals had nowhere to go. Oh no. Yeah, you guys have a lot of big cats, and like you said, there's a lot of great stories, and in the tours, we got to learn a lot of their stories, and one of the stories that I think is really interesting is about Zabu over here. Can you tell us a little bit about her? Well, we have Zabu, and she's a white tiger, and that's her boyfriend in the back, and that's Cameron. No <laughs> chance, huh? I uh, can't get into that. Yeah, they're, they're making out a little bit earlier, so. I was trying. Yeah. She's taken, sorry. So if a tiger and a lion produce, is that a liger? That's a liger, absolutely. Okay, so there is such a thing as a liger. We don't have any ligers here. You know, ligers are kind of a bad thing. There's not a lot of these animals left in the wild. So the ones we do have in captivity, we should be trying to preserve the species, not make weird, freaky things just for people to look at. Now, do you guys have babies? Here? No, we don't have any babies at the sanctuary. You know, we, we turn down a lot of cats just because we're limited uh, to, by space and money. So it would really not do any good to make more animals that wouldn't have a home. Yeah, and, and this is a great home and a huge place that you have here for all these cats. It can get pretty expensive to run this place. How much does it cost to run a place like this and feed all these big guys and girls? Well, you know, believe it or not, it costs over $1,000 a day just to buy the food and pay the vet bill. So it does get very expensive. Wow, and this is such a great cause. I'm sure there's people out there that just want to figure out how can they give money to this place? How can they help it keep running? We you know, the easiest way, you can go to our website and it lists all of the ways that you can help cats um, here at the sanctuary and even in the wild. But if you really want to see what Big Cat Rescue is about, just come out and take a tour. Yeah, come out. It's a lot of fun, definitely. Right, and it's, we're not open like a zoo, so you can't just come and wander around, but we do offer guided tours every day except Sunday. And Monday through Friday, that happens at 9 o'clock in the morning and 3 in the afternoon. And then on Saturday at 9 o'clock, we have our kids tour, and then we do three other tours throughout the day on Saturday. So check our website for times. And that's www.bigcatrescue.org, right? Absolutely. Is there a petting time? No, there's no petting time. You know, a lot of these animals came from places where, you know, they were exploited, where people did use them to pet them when they were babies. Yeah, you'd probably lose an arm if you started to, to pet one of these Not animals. a good idea. That's <laughs> bad for everyone yes. when that happens. But Scott, thank you so much. I mean, we've learned a lot. We've got to see a lot of great things. Really appreciate it. Where are you located again? We are 12802 Easy Street, which is right across the street from the Citrus Park Mall in Citrus Park area of Tampa. Right, or you can give them a call for tour times, right? 813-920. 4130. Yes. Correct. Again, their website is also www.bigcatrescue.org. We're going to check out some more of the cats here, and while we do that, we're going to show you some other cool things that we